In this short video, I'll cover what you can do with Reverie and how to do it. The main building block in Reverie is what we call a river. And there are three different types of river, source to target rivers, logic rivers, and action rivers. Source to target rivers are used to create simple data pipelines that get data from your source and push the data into your target destination. Reverie supports over 180 different sources, such as Salesforce, Google Ads, and Oracle, and all of the popular data warehouses as targets. For example, here's a source to target river that pulls data from Facebook ads and then loads it into a Snowflake data warehouse. Rivery makes the process easy and simple by automatically identifying the structure of incoming data and then creating the target tables and columns as needed. Rivery also provides version history and save all of the previous versions of a river so you can always view or revert back to a previous version of a river. Next, we have Action Rivers. Action Rivers provides an easy way to either ingest data from a REST API as a data source or push data to an API as a target. For example, we'd use an action river to pull data from a custom API endpoint, or we could push data into a CRM such as HubSpot. Here's an example of an action river that posts messages to a Slack channel. Lastly, we have logic rivers. Logic rivers are used for data transformations and workflow orchestration and can also include other rivers inside of them. For data transformations, you can use either SQL for in-warehouse transformations or Python for more complex scenarios. Rivery's orchestration supports branching, multi-step processes, conditional loops, logic, and more, and it makes it really easy to create complex workflows. For example, here's a logic river which pulls data from Monday and stores it into a Snowflake data warehouse. The logic river includes several source to target rivers that pull data from specific API endpoints and then push it into Snowflake. It then runs a SQL script to select some of the data. It then loops over the results from the SQL script and takes some more action with some specific branching. Next, we have Rivery Kits. Rivery kits are like starter kits that provide out-of-the-box templates for many common use cases, such as pulling data from Google Ads and pushing it into your warehouse. Kits include all of the rivers and settings required to run that kit. You can see all of our available kits on the kits page and then install them in literally a couple of clicks. Rivery also supports environments and deployment packages. Rivery supports multiple environments, each with its own rivers and environment variables. So you can give each development lifecycle stage, such as dev, staging, production, its own environment. Deployment packages are then used to copy rivers and their settings from one environment to another. Environments can also be used to support multiple internal teams, each with its own walled off environment. Rivery also supports variables as an easy way to use the same values across multiple rivers or across multiple environments, automate processes, or even pass values from one river to another. If you have any questions, you can send us an email at contact at rivery.io, or you can go to our documentation at docs.rivery.io, or you can quickly and easily open a support ticket by clicking on the support icon at the bottom left-hand corner. That's it. Thanks.